Hi and welcome to a new video. Do you want your wallpaper to automatically change whenever you tap on the lock screen? In this video, I'll show you how to set up Photo Shuffle on your iPhone's lock screen. Let's go. In the previous iOS versions, you need to use the Shortcuts app to do this. But with iOS 16, this feature is now built in. To enable it, go to the lock screen of your iPhone and long press in the middle of the screen, swipe to the right, and click on the plus button. Then choose Photo Shuffle from the top menu. By default, Apple finds some featured photos from your device that might be compatible with your wallpaper preference. For a more personal touch, tap on Choose Photos Manually. Then you can choose each photo individually from your gallery. But if you've already prepared your wallpaper collection prior to setting this up, simply go to the Albums tab and select a certain album. Choose your photos and tap on Add to proceed. You can create an album with up to 50 photos that you want to include in the wallpaper shuffle. To zoom in, zoom out, or move around the wallpaper, pinch the screen to the size and direction you prefer. You can also add filters by swiping to the right or left. Note that if you set a filter for a photo, it will also be applied to all other images included in the shuffle. To change the font style of your lock screen, click on the clock icon. You can also tap on the Add Widgets button and select from the available choices. To review all the wallpapers you have selected, tap on this grid icon on the bottom left of the screen and then add or delete photos according to what you prefer. Then tap on Done to confirm your changes. Now to set the shuffle frequency, tap the three dots found on the bottom right of the screen. You can set it to change your wallpaper every day, hourly, every time you open your phone or by tapping the screen. Once you're done customizing, click on Add. After your iPhone is done saving it, you will be asked whether you prefer to have a paired wallpaper or a separate home screen. If you select Set as Wallpaper Pair, you will have the same lock and home screen background. Moreover, if you choose Customize Home Screen, there are different tabs here from which you can choose how you would like to personalize your home screen. Once you're OK with how your screen should look like, tap on Done. The new update is great, but if you want to add more automation to your wallpaper, such as setting a specific action to trigger the shuffle, I recommend using the Shortcuts app. If you want to know more about this, check out the video on the tag above and the description below. That's it. If I could help you, feel free to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions. See you next time. Bye.